All right, so camera capture technology has always sought to mimic human experiences at, uh, as close as possible. Some companies have done this extremely well, like Kodak, who built a photography empire in the, uh, in the analog era. Canon, Sony, and Nikon right now are the digital leaders. And GoPro, names like GoPro and Flipcam became household names in the consumer era for digital cameras. My name is Ryan Abari. I am a marketing specialist at Lizard VR, where we believe to have created the next stage of uh, digital imaging technology and um, content creation. We do that through uh, our camera called the Lucid Cam. And that's the Lucid Cam right here. So in 2016, 3D VR content had a spike in demand. There was over 10 million video views in VR. Of these 10 million views, 21 million were on YouTube VR alone. And then there was 33 million video VR app downloads, meaning consumers are watching it at home, on their mobile devices, on the go, in their Google Cardboards, Google Daydreams, any type of headset you can find. There's a, a projected Kager rate of 128% year over year, year over year for the next three years until 2020. But there is one problem. Not all of us in this room are creating 3D VR. We're not shooting it right now in 3D VR, and we're not uh, consuming it on a daily basis. The reasons why is because right now the hardware is extremely expensive and bulky to carry around, and this hardware creates large data files, I'm talking terabytes of data, and the po post-processing time could take up to hours. So if you wanted to watch this pitch, a one minute or six minute pitch in 3D VR, you'd have to probably wait around five hours for all of this post-processing to be done. To bring 3D VR to everybody, you have to have a scalable, small, compact, consumer-priced consumer uh, product which outputs small data files and has real-time 3D VR processing, meaning it's instantaneous and the user could experience it within a second. So that's exactly what we do with the Lucicam. We put 3D VR into a small compact device priced at $499, which reprojects 3D VR, transfers it directly, directly to your phone or your mobile device to be able to view in 3D VR real time. Uh, you could see hmm, the, <laughs> the traction. So in 2015, we had um, 5K in revenue and we were founded actually uh, in January 2015. We launched at Indiegogo uh, in December 2015, which was successful. 2016, we ended the year with 150K in revenue. Um, 2017, we started shipping last month uh, to our Indiegogo backers and we will be going into mass production next month. We've piloted uh, with broadcasters, so our go-to-market is partnering with production companies and education institutions uh, for content creation as well as training purposes for education. Um, sold hundreds of units, and then we are a team of eight people right now, located right across the street. We're super excited to get the Lucicam into everybody's hands and. Hopefully 3D, 3D VR has the next wave of uh, content creation. Thank you. Thank you very much.